Okay, it looks like there's some people that are starting to gather. I was having some technical difficulties. Uh, the, um, hey Jane and JP, um, the internet connection in the church isn't always very good. <laughs> um, so, oh, hi Janet, I miss you. Um, I miss you too, Jane and JP. Um, so, and then I was like running late and anyway, here we are and it's time to say our prayers. So thank y'all for being here. Let's begin. So we're the noonday prayer. Um, the bulletin is on the main page of the website if you need the bulletin. Hi, Jan. Let's begin. Oh God, make speed to save us. O oh Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Amen. We'll read together uh, Psalm 119. Your word is a lantern to my feet, and a light upon my path. I have sworn and am determined to keep your righteous judgments. I am deeply troubled. Preserve my life, O Lord, according to your word. Accept, O Lord, the willing tribute of my lips and teach me your judgments. My life is always in my hand, yet I do not forget your law. The wicked have set a trap for me, but I have not strayed from your commandments. Your decrees are my inheritance forever. Truly, they are the joy of my heart. I have a it keeps, I, I don't know if it's pausing for you all, but I'm just gonna keep going. So sorry if it's messy. I, I don't know how to fix it. This is a reading from 2 Corinthians. If anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has passed away. Behold, the new has come. All this is from God, who through Christ reconciled us to himself and gave us the ministry of reconciliation. Thanks be to God. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, I pray. Heavenly Father, send your Holy Spirit into our hearts to direct and rule us according to your will, to comfort us in all our afflictions, to defend us from all error, and to lead us into all truth. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Lord Jesus Christ, you said to your apostles, peace I give to you, my peace I leave with you. Regard not our sins, but the faith of your church, and give to us the peace and unity of that heavenly city, where with the Father and the Holy Spirit, you live and reign now and forever. Amen. Let us name before God those for whom we offer our prayers. In our parish, we pray for Carla Liverman, Dora, Emily Bregoris, Susan Klopp, Ian Young and Children, Jim Saunders, Rodney Noland, Mary Jo Bowling, the Walter family, Joan Kuntz, Frank Burney, Jeff Jones, Eric Jewett, Lori Foreman, Sophia, Todd Gooch and family, Jackie and her family, Todd McAnley, and Ashlyn Davis. God the Father, your will for all people is health and salvation. We praise you and thank you, O Lord. God the Son, you came that we might have life and might have it more abundantly. We praise you and thank you, O Lord. God the Holy Spirit, you make our bodies the temple of your presence. We praise you and thank you, O Lord. Holy Trinity, one God, in you we live and move and have our being. We praise you and thank you, O Lord. Lord, grant your healing grace to all who are sick. 
injured or disabled, that they may be made whole. Hear us, O Lord of life. Grant to all who seek your guidance and to all who are lonely, anxious, or despondent, a knowledge of your will and an awareness of your presence. Hear us, O Lord of life. Mend broken relationships and restore those in emotional distress to soundness of mind and serenity of spirit. Hear us, O Lord of life. Bless physicians, nurses, and all others who minister to the suffering, granting them wisdom and skill, sympathy and patience. Hear us, O Lord of life. Grant the dying peace and a holy death and uphold by the grace and consolation of your Holy Spirit, those who are bereaved. Hear us, O Lord of life. Restore to wholeness whatever is broken by human sin in our lives, in our nation, and in the world. Hear us, O Lord of life. You are the Lord who does wonders. You have declared your power among the peoples. With you, O Lord, is the well of life and in your light we see light. Hear us, O Lord of life. Heal us and make us whole. The Almighty Lord, who is a strong tower to all who put their trust in him, to whom all things in heaven, on earth, and under the earth bow and obey, be now and evermore our defense, and make us know and feel that the only name under heaven given for health and salvation is the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Almighty and eternal God, giver of life and all we possess, we offer prayers for this time of COVID-19. Thank you for giving us first responders, doctors, nurses, and all healthcare workers. Give them wisdom and discernment as they care for patients and families and keep them safe. We ask you to visit and comfort all those who are sick or suffering, and we remember all those who have died. Thank you for giving them to us to know and love as companions on our journey. Grant them an entry into your eternal light and life and the fellowship of all your saints. We remember before you all those who are unsafe vulnerable to infection, unemployed, and those who can't risk missing another day of work. We remember those who are isolated, anxious, and vulnerable. Grant us all strength, wisdom, courage, and discernment as we seek to follow you. All this we ask through our Lord Jesus Christ, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. Well, I'm sorry about all the technological <laughs> glitches. Um, it looks like it finally started able to sustain. Uh, for those of you who are watching later, um, let us know that you were here and that you offered your prayers with us. It just continues to build a sense of uh, connectedness. I also want to make sure that uh, many of you know that we are having these virtual coffee hours uh, through Zoom, and the link to those was sent out in the parish email. There's one today at 1230, and then there's another one um, tomorrow at 5. If that is something that you would like to be a part of, um, Please uh, contact the office and we'll make sure that you have the correct link in order to jo join those calls. Um, I think that that's all for now. If you ever have someone that you want to make sure is on our parish prayer list, uh, prayer list uh, please don't hesitate to add their name to the comments of these um, prayer times or to send me an email or send something to the office. It is so good seeing your names, even if I can't see your faces. And please know that we are praying for everyone in our parish and in our community every day. Peace be with you, and I hope to see you soon.